every time I've been over the phone, over the phone, right, over the phone. Right, right, right. And I've been saying, girl, you've been here, or flip, you right. know what I'm saying? So, I think the last time we actually do in phase interview of Fusion is. Man, that's taking it way back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's way like, back. It's like 12 years ago. Yeah, minimum. Oh, wow. Yeah. Minimum. Yeah, man. All right, yeah. but. But was a fan of the music then? Yeah, I, still I, a fan of and the music. I'm a supporter. I'm yeah. a supporter. I always yeah. been. I always say you've been one of them, you know. You know, you have certain certain people like, you know, they do they with a popularity thing. You always been fair. Equal. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, it's, I feel like it's necessary in the market. Yeah, I mean um, there's a few. There's a few, so yeah. you gotta cherish them, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. All right. Now, okay, so well bro. That last song that you, you dropped off was a problem. Um, All right. Listen, that thing, that thing right there, that thing right there. Mm-hmm. Man! Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, before me blowing up saying to I'm sure. I'm sure. Everybody been loving it. It began some good response, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out to Daddy Jones. It was an amazing interview. I had a great time, you know what I'm saying? So Actually at one point Daddy Jones texted me and he was like, getting goosebumps. <laughs> No, like, it, it, it's it's cool to, you know, when you're in the studio and then the creative process, mm-hmm. it's like, we all looking at each other like, yo, this one, this is dope. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but when you're actually... Are you really sure? Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Uh, you don't know, you don't know until you know, because at the same time, what you might think is dope might not hit the people. Right. And then what you might think is trash, right. it'll be the one. Like, yeah, it's weird, man. I, I never forget, like, I had a rhythm might produce Dark Up. Yeah. For cool breeze, yeah. and I just didn't think it was amazing, like it. But everybody loved it, and I was like, you know what? Well, if who, am I, to, who right. am I to say anything? They know? like it, I love if, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you got rule with it, just like that. No doubt, no yes, doubt. Who? So now, yes, who? <laughs> yeah, so now yeah. you you got some uh, new music today. Uh huh. Yes. Um. What? Well, well, first of all, you do know we're playing that record before you leave. Yeah. Um. With that being said, we got some new music today. Some new fire. All right. Mm. Uh, compared to what you came here with last week, where does this stack up? Everything is in its own lane. Okay. So, so that the one I released last week is more the walk up situation. Now I have international feel. Okay. And then I have the mid bunks. So it's like every I try to hit every target. Well, and then don't forget you had that the people really yeah yeah too. and that's the Afrobeat yeah. so it's like I try I try hit every market this kind of one and I'm saying and just show them the versatility all right you know well definitely you know, I always have to be the ha 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 rap 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 chuk chuk jam jam hada hada waka in the kind of rap yeah I mean it's crazy you know <laughs> I, have, I have had people come and hear me perform and they'll be like oh my god I didn't know you could really sing right. and it's like okay <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Yo, cause they just know you're for the calypso, the walk up thing. So it's like sometimes you gotta show them like, yo, there's more. Sometimes you like an onion, gotta peel the layers. Huh? Check, check. All right. Well, this isn't gonna make anybody cry, I'm sure. <laughs> uh, wh- which one we gonna play first? Okay, which one you have loaded up? Ah, uh, either one. Send the alcohol. That woo. Yeah. Okay. Let me let me start with another alcohol. So this this one is more more that international feel. <laughs> okay. That chicken and Johnny cake okay. in the village. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little shot of rum. Uh-huh. We're ready for carnival. This is what it is. Uh-huh. This one cast it on the alcohol. Let we go. You know what? Through the village music, yeah, yo, that song was dope. Like it yeah. had, it had that sound like, like anybody who's made it, like Biggie Irie, like, mm-hmm. like that kind of old song. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's what I'm looking well, for. You know what I'm saying? Not only our village, it could play anywhere. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I could definitely like, hear that. And that's what I'm going for. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes we just got 
imprint our DNA someplace else. Some, you know, so yeah. through the music, I feel like that's one of them that could play on any island at any groove. DJs could just take the instrumental, spin it, 30 minutes, you know, it's just a groove. Is that yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm looking for. Right. Well, I, I think you found everything you're looking for musically, man. Yeah. Um, it's 2023. You've been in this game for... A boy this year makes 20 years, yeah. believe it or not. Yeah. Oh, I started wow. at 13 um, in 2003. Yeah, with Fairless Man right out there in St. Thomas. Yeah. Me, Gus, Mosiah, other people. And it's been a run and it's been great, you know. Four road match, three Banarama championships, party monarch champion. I, why could say it's been blessed. See, yeah. and, and that's that's. I don't know. It, it's weird to say it, but that's what I like about my interviews because I get you the opportunity to say things like that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, normally people just kind of brush that off. What? Hey, let's talk about this new you know, song you, you know, got today. You know what happened? I feel like when people are always refer to me as like the Tim Duncan of Calypso. Because they'll okay. be like, you're just humble. You right. just do what you got to do. You're effective. You come in the game. You score. Yeah. And that's it. And I go I, home. I mean, <laughs> go home and record, play with the kids. The records, <laughs> the records speak for itself, you know. Yeah. If, I, if I retire now, the records speak for itself. I produce some of the greatest music and I had a good time doing yeah. it. Yeah. All right, now it's still I'm, doing it, most important. It's still doing it, you know what I'm saying? It's still doing it to the utmost. Okay, all right. So now uh, we got another one. Hold on, I got to stretch out for this uh-oh, one. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay. uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Now, ladies, they say the deadline is Friday to pay your costume, then, right? My but, costume don't pay for So somehow in costume <laughs> ain't pay. I just lay in there. I know one like, man. I don't have those problems. What one man won't do, a next man will. Somehow I look too good for just one money. It's true. Mm. Lay in there, I know. It's true. Somehow I look too good. Thanks. So I, this I one is. <laughs> it's, 20, it's 2023, you know. <laughs> I've been thinking the other day, I do need another boyfriend. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Oh, wow. I mean, think about it. You got nails, hair, boot, right? Take it, fought, fed, take right, it. Right, right. That's right. a lot of pressure for one man. It yeah, is. Yeah, it is. Split it evenly, you know. Yeah. It is. Split in the middle. <laughs> Teamwork make the dream work. I tell you. I'm yeah. Phil Jackson. Kobe and Shaq. Thank you. Bam, bam. Thank you. Win that championship, baby. Triangle. <laughs> <laughs> hey! <laughs> With- <laughs> Um, a lot of your friends will would not be in agreement. Um, hey, listen. <laughs> to each his own. I uh-huh. may take my boss, just nobody, and give me a shoulder to cry on it. It's so, true. Mm. To each his own. Mm. I just let it be known. We're in 2023, and somehow you look too good for just one man. Mm. You know? Triangle. Hey. <laughs> I just saying. Girl, you look so good. Right? You look so good. I do. Thank you so much. I, I do deserve another boyfriend. They, they're not wrong with it. It's just a little help for carnival. Just a little help. Just a little help. Financial help. Right? Right? <laughs> <laughs> Risha over there running the triangle. I'm telling her, don't be surprised. It's going to be one of the anthem them for carnival. And then you hear them, girl, I deserve two. You're right. I deserve yeah. three. Maybe five. Five. Eight. Five. Whoa. Seven. Ten. Whoa. 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 Don't be surprised. Ladies, we Phil Jackson. <laughs> Ah. Don't be surprised. We're ah. Phil Jackson with Kobe and Shaq and Phil Jackson with Pippin and Jordan. <laughs> We're not playing with them this carnival. <laughs> We're running the triangle, okay? Like Only the go. best, though. <laughs> 
Let's go. Only you, superstars. You huh? find you Only find superstars on your roster. Correct. You <laughs> find ladies. You find your Shaq and you find your Kobe and you run the place. Uh-huh. You you make sure both of your 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 players know what they're doing. Uh-huh. Everybody Shaq, play a position. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Shaq play his Point position. Guard. Kobe play his position. Center. Yeah. If you want to do a starting five, yeah, yeah, yeah. please give them the positions uh-huh. that they that they need to play. A syllabus. Yes. A point syllabus. guard. Yeah, yeah. Point guard, shooting guard, small forward. Not even a playbook, a syllabus. A Power syllabus. forward. This is course correct. We took this to university level. And course center. Correct. Yeah. yeah, and the center. And if and if you like me, yeah, six months. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. Listen. Oh man, oh man, oh man. I was like, let's put it out your game. Yes, this is this. how these girls didn't get down. This is 2023. But when you're honest, you know? Yeah, you know? Don't get left behind. Listen, a lot of men, a lot of men that ask if you get a man, no, you know? No, no, I don't ask them questions. Well, some men do. I don't ask them. Maybe you got a man. No, you gotta ask them more important questions. Which is? Which is? Is anybody out there think there's your man? Oh, that's 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 the question. Mm. That's the question. Some crazy yeah. people out there say, yeah, yeah, ask that question. That's the question. The aim that if you have a man, you get somebody out there that think that's your man, that think <laughs> that's your woman. Because if you, if you do, leave me alone. Leave <laughs> well, me yeah, alone. this one ain't gonna be a problem for Carnival for mm-hmm. sure. Right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know that. Ladies, triangle. You know, I have. I, I think I have about two more songs. I love when you do the whistle. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah man so you got more music still yeah i have one more track coming out with a quad and okay. that's daddy jones again i okay. like Listen. Rashidi. i Listen. hear it oh, I, hear, I, hear, I hear i hear it I when like. somebody turns their head on that angle Rashidi. Rashidi. oh you heard it I got, yeah i gonna let you know from now i was in the if studio you thought the last one or anything this one giving me a puzzle vibe. Really? Yes, yes, yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's giving me that guy now vibe. Oh, yeah? Like, 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 like. This one ain't gonna be an anthem. And it ain't gonna just be for carnival. This one ain't gonna be for a while. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. One of those. One of them yeah. ones. And then I got one more tune coming out named Jube. Okay. Jube? Yeah. Okay. I'm looking at Jube. Just a bay for Jube alone. Oh. Check. Yeah. I like that yeah. concept. Yeah. Yeah. Unite the sporting goods, we need the horn. Oh, matter of fact, <laughs> hold on. Keep How we got it to him? Okay, United Sporting Goods, because you know we've been asking. I've been asking nicely. It's so Fapi bad. Be you you check? Be. It's I'm so bad, right? <laughs> that people was inboxing me and texting my phone. Ah, you ain't get no horn yet? Like oh, God. <laughs> you serious? Oh my god. <laughs> But no, I Jube, I like that. Eh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Looking at Jube. Yeah, yeah. I artists they don't throw teeth by shit. But you know, you know, that's a double entendre. Exactly. Shh. 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 They pay game ain't like my you know, they don't. Yeah. You got you got pass out the artists on the read. I go I go pour I I can buy listen, I go make some shots at all. Jube. I'm looking at Jube. Yeah. That's a hand? Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. There we go. Uh-huh. My boy came back. Okay. okay. I really got it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right, we're back in business. Shout out to United Sporting Goods over there in St. Croix, Red Brick area, for all your fishing and horniness. All right. <laughs> there you go. All right, so, um, no, the music has been amazing so far. Uh, not just you, but everybody, everybody that has come through. Yeah, everybody. I don't feel like every year everybody stepped their game up mm. so, tremendously. Who's got your favorite song that you are not affiliated with? Right now? Mm-hmm. Uh, Kwan. Um, Cisa. Oh no, you said I'm not affiliated. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Cisa. Um, I buy us. Okay. I home team, home team, gang, gang, all the way. Right? I don't care. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I buy us right now. I rooting for Cisa and Quad right now. Okay. Yeah. All right. What, what did you work on for Cisa? Um, Hot Girl Party. Okay. So did you produce the previous two songs we just listened to? Yes. All right. Yeah. Produce both of them. Yeah. What is your musical talent besides the voice? Like, what do you play? Bass, guitar, drums, trumpet, saxophone, keyboard. Damn. Guitar. Yeah. Um, Did not know that. Yeah, I've been. Uh, well, I was classically trained in piano from four years old. My mother put me into oh. um, piano. Big up to Sierra. And I was actually mad because I never wanted to play piano. I wanted to play violin. Oh wow. Yeah, I always wanted to play violin, and up to now I've never picked up a violin. But that's that's something I will do. Okay. But, yeah, um, 
Many people don't know I play a lot of instruments. Right. Yeah, I, I grew up in a whole band scene, marching band under Georgia Francis. Oh, another, oh, another yeah. product yeah, yeah, of yeah, Georgia yeah. Francis. Yeah, and she's one of them. When you when she sees talent, she'll take you under your wing and you become one of her kids. So from ninth grade, she used to send me to like jazz camp and marching band camps. Every summer, I would be at another camp, you know, or or working for her. So. So yeah. I'm going to ask you, let, what, what yeah. makes that lady so special? Her name comes up like all the time. What, what makes Georgia Francis so special? And what That's it, OG. The respect level. Mm-hmm. She's, she's that, mother, that mother figure that you just don't disrespect. Like, like you more afraid of Georgia than you're afraid of your parents. Like, like it's, it's crazy. She just have that authoritative figure. And you, with how she going to take care of you, like, like you want to own. And you learn and you get experiences out of this world like I said me being a band I got to go to Argentina you know yeah. what I'm saying I got to go to the Georgia Dome yeah. I got to go to New York to perform um, perform in the um, Stars and Stripes um, competition so with her you just got a lot of experiences and once she love you she got your back you know what I'm saying also Rising Stars was an intricate part of my life too Okay, I was in Rising Stars from 9 years old to like about 17 damn you didn't have time for sports no, I was okay. not a sport. I learned oh. at a very young age I suck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sports is never my thing. When everybody was playing baseball and basketball, I was like, eh. I'm going to just go see this music Steve thing. Yeah. Yeah. Steve, I'm practice at 2 o'clock. Nice to talk to you. Uh, yeah, it, I just, sports was never my thing. Okay. I just talk for nothing. Right. All right, uh, I just got a text message from Ibari. He says, G friend could kill all your bad man energy with one look. Yeah, yeah. I, I tell the you. baddest are bad man listen, too. Listen, <laughs> the most bad man them you know in school were afraid of her. Like, like it's just a respect level. Like, she just had it, and we were our, everybody who went through her gonna love her endlessly. Like that's, okay. that's just we saw extensions, and you see it from Luben yeah, to yeah, Ibari. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Everybody who went through her doing something good in music, Rain, Tafari. You know what I'm saying? There's numerous people to mention. Right, right. All right, well, okay, so um, 9.56 in the morning, mm-hmm. you dropped off two two more bangers. Uh-huh. Um, by the way, Abari said, take your foot off of everybody else's neck. Yeah. <laughs> I just ain't got no limit right now, man. Right now, I just in the studio every day. Like, really, she going to tell you, you should have pop up sometimes. I ain't there every day. And everybody will be like, how much songs are you doing? I, I don't know. Whenever I feel like stopping, I stop it. What, what caused this resurgence? Like, where, where does energy come I've from? I've been loafing for a while. Okay. I've been mm-hmm. loafing for a while. I feel like I've been putting my energy into other artists and bands and stuff. And there's nothing wrong with that. I took a break from, from actually singing for like five years. And I was more focused into the production when I had my band Cool Breeze. It was more out of mode and my right. You know what I'm saying? And then I used to always get it. And it's... It used to be um, Adam Little Brother Ace, I rest in peace. He used yeah, to always be sure. like, yo, you need to start releasing more music. Like, you need, you, you bad, you know, sitting on loafing. And it's like, this year I, I made a promise to myself, okay, you ain't in no band, you ain't doing nothing, focus on the music. Focus on just releasing. And it's been a, a great experience. Well, we're, we're thankful that you had this epiphany. This yeah, 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 yeah. It's come to Jesus Better moment within everybody. yourself. <laughs> no, for sure, man. You're I mean, shady. That's super talent. Me and Kwan. I was in the studio when they were recording it. Well, actually, I would. Yeah, but you know, you know what's crazy? I was hearing it. You should ask Squeezy. I like. Ooh, I said that's a hit. <laughs> like, I was talking to I've myself. been doing this music thing so long. Like, it have sometimes that you don't forget certain songs or certain stuff you do. Because, like, Kwan and, and somebody were cussing me the other day about Love Walk, a song I do with Sha. And I didn't even, I can't even tell you how the song You go. did! And they were like, the man, that, that was my song, that was my song. And I, I can't even tell you <laughs> how that song to go. Like, it'll just be, when you're in a zone sometimes and you're just recording, recording, it'll just be fun, man. No, I tell people, like, I tell a lot of artists, like, A Plus is definitely the artist that you need to be in the studio with. Because A plus, I did tell A plus he to turn into G front. I, I like when me I like Stop to do it. a lot of say it over again. Yeah, You're supposed I, to say it like this and not like that. I like, the first time he do that, I'm like, this is Adrian. Like I couldn't even believe it. Like, I'm a perfectionist, shocking. but I mean, if you trust me, you're gonna get a great result. Definitely, right, that you're looking for. You know what I'm saying? I, one thing I really love to do in the studio is, is vocal. Um, 
vocal, vocal direct, coaching, yeah, coaching, vocal yeah. coaching and vocal direction. Because to me, I like to bring the best out of the artist. And I have people in there. I can't harmonize. I can't sing. The, you ever try? No. Right. And then you be surprised. You? Yeah, you you be surprised. Like you be surprised at the end of the day, they'll be like, "Wow, Calvin, you get out of me." Yeah, you just gotta know where you're going with it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, everybody could could do. Some people could just coach and teach. You know? Plus, teach me how to harmonize. Yeah. Just by sitting down in the studio where he and Jordan. I like anything is possible. Yeah, though. so like when yeah. plus you remember the karaoke when I was singing, mm-hmm. and <laughs> Adrian was shocked because he heard me harmonizing with the song, and he like, "That's you." And I like, I've been practicing, dog. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, you're working on your road march. Yeah, I am. I am. Uh, you got a, a, a few uh, road march contenders at this point. Hey. Adrian gonna help me. He's my vocal coach. Okay. Hey, ain't nothing wrong well, right with it, man. I honestly. Bill I, Jackson. The road march thing, I, yeah. I, I ain't really concerned about road march. Just I, making good music. Yeah, I had my time with competing in the road march. And like I said, and with my championships, I good. You yeah. know, Right now, I just want to expand. That's my, my goal. Expand as an artist and a brand. You know what I'm saying? Letting everybody know that this is the type of music I'm presenting. And there's even more. You know, summertime, I'm going to be doing some dance hall and stuff. So. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I'm looking Ooh. forward to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I dance, love your dance. Dance hall and reggae is my really... Yeah. My real passion. That's okay. that's why I really love the most. All right. But well, we don't have enough dancehall artists. I, I've been I, saying that's that. I've been saying we, that. Too. Everybody like, been I saying. I feel like we only have like three or yeah. four. Jubal. We have Jubal. We have um, King Lion. We have. It, but King Lion is very reggae to me. Kai, no, but he the in that. But dancer. um, a Dream Phillips. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. He's in dancehall too. The boy too. from yeah. um, Saint Croix a Million. Yeah. Yeah. And then General. You know. Like, that's it. We, Short list. Yeah, we really don't have dance hall. And it's crazy because you would think we'd have more. Like. But the thing is, when you listen to the dance hall artists, the songs are not bad. So they're, they're like, good. What is, yeah, they're, what is they're the really issue? Like, I feel like we haven't created a lane for it mm. because there's not enough artists in it. So we haven't created. Like now, VI rap just started to take it off, you know? Right. And there's enough yeah. rappers now. We could say, okay, I could throw a show and at least have 15 artists on it and. There's gonna be at least 200 people that knows at least one of these man songs. We don't have enough on our lane for dance, huh? right? So I mean, and it takes time. It takes time and support. You know yeah. what I'm saying? One thing that I always preach to my VI people: we have to support our local artists more. Well, hey, listen, man, we, we're here to do our part. I'm looking forward to your dance hall. Mm. Uh, you got some songs that could possibly make it to the number one spot on our countdown every Friday. Uh, we are actually going to start broadcasting the top 20 countdown again, um, probably starting next week. Uh, uh, so the top this 20. This is my first time, I need $100. <laughs> $100 every week up to $1,200 could be yours, brother. All right, no problem. So I could just... I could, I could just cheat and bring a song every week. If you want, <laughs> if you want, compete against yourself. That's one of them ones, man. Yeah. yeah that's that one of them beast. ones, yeah. man. It's crazy. It's crazy. Oh. Dude. Hey. Amari said, uh. Plus, teach me how to harmonize, actually. Oh, wow. Plus, just outside, teach your people how to harmonize. No, I mean, me and Barry go back since high school days. Right. You know what I'm saying? We used to all be in the band room lunchtime playing and stuff. Yeah. So yeah, I, I mean, I teach a lot of people a lot of stuff. I just don't, I'm not a person to go around bragging a person. I, I never been me, I ain't gonna never be me. You know what I'm saying? But I have credited to a lot of people's career and right. I just wish them the best. Well, do you get the credit or not? No, my, my credit is just seeing them do good. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get that feeling sometimes. That's like, a big bar. Like to me, that's, that's the credit. I help you. Okay, now you're doing good. Like that's, that's good enough for right. me. Whether you want to admit it or not. Yeah. That, yeah. It, even if you don't want to admit it. You know. It, 
I know you no. know. You know what I'm no. saying? So it's like that's good enough for me. Just to see you blossom and your career taking off in ways that I could have helped. If I could help your career anyway, better. You know I know you, you talk about the coaching that you do in the studio sessions. Uh, uh, Jones does that as well. Yeah. Uh, what have you learned from him as, as a producer and an artist specifically? Um, it's kind of weird because I think he treats me with so much respect. Like, mostly when we just have a, a, a weird chemistry. So it's like, I think I have exactly what he's looking for. No, I'm so, telling you, man. Like, he sought you out for this particular record. Like, yeah. this is the man for this record. And damn it, he was right. Yeah. And it's just weird because we don't, we, we, I try and think if we ever been in a studio together. I think the only time we ever been in a studio together was probably blah, blah. All right. Everything else is just more been, he sent me, I sent him back, he love it, and we just rock from there, you know what I'm saying? But I just feel like I, I know the sweet science of approaching his rhythms. Yeah. I, I, I can't explain it, like, but it'll just fit. No, it, and it fit perfectly, like a glove mm -hmm. uh, on this. That, that last record, mm -hmm. like I'm telling you, like you gotta find artists from anywhere. Like the only other person I think that, that could have attacked that better and not, not writing off the coattails of, of what Avalanche just did, mm. Bungie Garland. But that's my idol, son. Like, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, 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 that's it. That's, that's, that's the Viking. You know yeah. what I'm I think Bungie will have fun on our rhythm. Oh my honest. God. Oh, field oh, day. He, he, yeah, that, that, field day. He, he would murder it. He yeah, would murder yeah. it. He would murder well, it. you murdered it, brother. Yeah, yeah. You murdered it. All right. Hey, thank you for spending some time. What, what you got? No, definitely. Especially how you deliver that drop, that beat. Be, like, you, like, before the bass line. I, mwah, like, come on, man. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. No, it's, it's, it's well done. Gearing up the bass line. Drop that beat. Because you don't see me over here doing the TikTok. Drop that beat. And then you leave. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I can't wait for parade day. I Bye. can't wait for all the I gigs. can't wait for Juve. Listen, yeah. This, yeah, yeah, yeah. this year I'm spectating. I'm having fun. I'm going up the road just So you're going to be on a truck for Juve? No. Oh, you, you seem like you made a commitment. No. This okay. year I am walking up. Did you hear okay. all the bands on the road for Juve? Rashid? I have not. Tell me. Vibe. Climax on the road? I have no idea. I don't know if Climax on the road. So Vibe. Carnage. Grandmasters, hmm. Asa Banton, hmm. Sha HP. Hmm. I'm not sure. Pompa or somebody truck though. Pompa with, sure. with yeah, he went um Insomniac, I think. Yeah, okay. with Avalanche, with right? Avalanche, yeah. yeah. yeah Pompa up, uh, yeah. Insomniacs back to their old old regular schedule. Their old people Avalanche Pompa. Juve is going to be crazy no, this year. If you want to press play, wanna... press play. yeah, press right. play all the Juve. I mean, have a, I mean, I think what they try and do is have like the Juve troops on the band. I don't know. I, I don't know. This but year, I am going up the road. They have me at Grand Masters and Ace Abanton. I'm going to be a fat skit again up the road. <laughs> <laughs> Poiling. <laughs> I'm boiling. We're going to be tired of this, this carnival. Yeah, again from Juve to Wet Fet and are you having fun? Right? Oh, yeah. And then the village, the Friday night, the Wednesday night. My only, my only, my only problem with carnival is this. I am old. I'm, I'm getting up there in age. Ah, the village nights. I'm getting up there in age, right? I cannot. How you gonna give me local night and juvie day? Like, I, Listen, I, go, I go dead. I Rashi, go dead. They call it sofrito night, dead. right? So it's Frankie Reyes, the okay. Prince of Bachata. Yeah. Asa Bantan. Triple K. Trip and Triple K. Goyo. Goyo and Vibe, though. Damn. The night before juvie. Damn. <laughs> Then you're supposed to go juve. Then you're supposed to come back <laughs> to the village, village pump back carnage, this boss in that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a lot. It's a lot. Hey, make sure you get your supplements in. Listen. Your vitamin intake. Listen. And then that's all. That's right. is Shensia. Everybody been asking me, you ain't going out this weekend? No. I got charged up because these knees, yourself. these knees old now. Like last year, boy, when carnival done, I had to... I need some bengi and some I, tiger barman. I sleep through the whole of uh, um, Beres Hammond. I was so vexed. Right after Drew, Not me. I went there being a rasta man. And this year I get my locks. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. I wear my jellyfish sandals, my fishnet shirt. Oh, damn. Oh, you're going authentic. Authentic. All right. I would try and go authentic last year, but I oversleep. I was All right, so I'm going to give you some uh, authentic jerk seasoning from Island Boy Cuisine. <laughs> there you go, my hey, brother. Hey, let's smell like a little 
kid. Uh, <laughs> you know what this could do? You could. My you. Uh, <laughs> you see my size? Okay. All right. Well, there you go. That is authentic <laughs> if, goodness. If, if I cook, when I say rich, rich, let him know. All right, when, when, you, when you cook up, you got to bring something to the studio. I got you. I got right. you. It's they thought we just manage us out of food all the right. time. Right. Right. So, Joe, oh, they say, let, let me, me do speak for potluck. myself. That's what I do. <laughs> Joe, they say, I can't do it, man. Cooking, cooking is very therapeutic. To me. It is. Well, when you, when you cook some jerk chicken, bring, bring something to the studio. I got you. I plus got you. Plus cook, though. Jordan cook, cook. Plus cook, cook. Listen, no. Joe, it was like, let me do our potluck. Well, well, fellas, I can eat. So yeah. when, when you make the food, bring the it is a santo. I had to learn. Hey. VI stars. VI music. VI culture. Yep. There's an app for that. It's called Vivid Streaming. And you can download it in the app and Google Play Store.